Hi, Norman Hallett here with your next four minute drill for traders. Last week, I asked you to answer a specific question. And that question was, if we were having this discussion three months from today, and you were looking back over those three months, what has to have happened in your life, both personally and professionally, for you to feel happy with your progress as a trader? Well, overwhelmingly, the responses were centered around being a more disciplined trader. Now, I don't know if you were just trying to make me feel good because you know that helping traders with their trading discipline is my thing, but I'm gonna take you at your word. So, what do we do next? You see yourself in 90 days being an ice in the veins disciplined trader, but how do you get there? The answer, the answer is make a plan that you can follow. Now understand that to be more disciplined in your trading, you need to change your habits. For whatever reason, for whatever reason you've developed a trading habit that does not serve you as a trader, you gotta change it. Maybe that's not having the patience to wait for a trade setup to complete because you think you can get a few more ticks if you get in early, or maybe you have a fear of pulling the trigger because you just lost in your last few trades. Whatever the problem, the situation, the habit that you wanna eliminate is for you, it's, it's a habit that's detrimental to your trading results. Now there are several specific ways to change your trading, your bad habits into good habits. And since I only have four minutes in this drill, I'll start and end with my favorite one. It's called emotional freedom technique. And we use this technique as one of the pillars to get fast results for our coaching clients. It's a technique that combines Eastern and Western disciplines. You, you use your fingers to tap on various energy points on your face and your body. The same points that are used in acupuncture and acupressure, and you tap those points in a specific sequence. Now at the same time, you're reciting specific statements that are statements of change. Now I know that this sounds a little strange to some people, but this is scientifically proven. And there is no question that it works and no question why it works. It works to change habits by separating the emotion from the thought. You see, thoughts and emotions are married. The stronger the thought, the stronger the emotion. The stronger the emotion, the stronger the thought. Okay, they're married. You can't separate them. You can't separate them. That's what we're doing with this technique. By tapping on your energy meridians while speaking statements of change, you're altering the energy flow between the thought and the emotion, which results in draining the emotion from the thought. And the absolute result is that the emotion is no longer attached to the thought. In fact, you may even find yourself finding it hard to bring up the thought that's been having you hesitate to take a trade or whatever the situation is. Again, this process is a mainstay of how we're getting traders disciplined in our coaching program. Now, I urge you to just go on YouTube and search for emotional freedom technique. Now, it's sometimes referred to as the tapping solution, but you'll find hundreds of videos on it. And learn how to create the right suggestions to make the change that you want to make while you're tapping those meridian points. Just do it. Go to YouTube and look it up. Okay, that's it for this edition of Four Minute Drill for Traders. So until next week, stay disciplined.